Hey Pisces, let's get started with your monthly read. This will be for July 2023. What message, what guidance do we have for Pisces? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Queen, Arthur, Kella. Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Y'all cards not coming together. What messages do we have for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus? Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Some of y'all are back and forth about a relationship. Two of Pentacles here with the two with the Hierophant popped out. So you guys are back and forth about a relationship. We're gonna put that to the side. Let's continue with the reading. Maybe something wasn't coming together. Six of Cups here in the past, something wasn't coming together in regards to a relationship. Star here, Aquarian energy here, Sun here. Woo! So Star Sun. Some of you guys are some of you guys are hopeful here. This is very hopeful energy here. Star Sun here, that's Aquarian energy, that's Leo energy here, Hangman, Scorpio energy, Four of Cups. Some of you guys are changing your perspective around a relationship, Queen of Wands here, because you're unhappy. Some of you guys may feel like you missed an opportunity here with this Queen of Wands. Seven of Cups here, there could be some confusion. Seven minus four is three cups. There was multiple people involved in a relationship situation. Four of Swords here. I feel like someone's trying to retreat from some sort of strife. High Priestess here. Trusting their intuition. Eight of Swords here. Someone needs to trust their intuition. Stuck mentally. Hermit here. So I feel like there's a new path here. Eight of Swords here. Someone was stuck uh, thinking because you see my Hermit here is focused on this Eight of Swords. Someone was stuck in their head about a relationship, back and forth about a relationship. Feel, may have missed an opportunity or feeling as though they're missing an opportunity here. Six plus four is 10 cups because of past relationship. So the third party may have been memories of the past or a past relationship. Got a lot of major arcana out here. Star here, Aquarian energy here that talks about wish fulfillment. Sun here, Leo energy here talks about seeing things clearly, new, new beginnings, rebirths. Hangman here is you see there's a light a lot of light shining around the sun and the head this is clarity here someone's gaining clarity seeing something from a different perspective um someone is unhappy and motivated here to make some sort of decision or retreat from a bunch of options so someone could have been dealing with a lot of options wanting to retreat from their high priestess there eight of swords knowing that they were keeping themselves restricted by being stuck off in their shell somebody could be coming out of their shell there I'm all in now, and I am running out. I'm coming up. I want the world to know. Somebody coming out of the show. Sorry. Sorry. Why is the star energy here? So we have the nine of pentacles here with the four of swords. Yeah, so, so someone here is confident about releasing, uh, recovery. Magician here taking some sort of action. Someone is recovering themselves, seeing things clearly now. Sun here. Four of Pentacles here. I feel like someone's holding back some sort of truth. Nine Swords. I mean, Knight of Swords here. Someone's moving forward with some sort of truth. Uh, hangman clarifying the motherfucking Hangman. Okay. This has been happening to me all day. So I definitely feel like someone is seeing something from a different perspective. Someone's vision has changed here. Judgment. And they're making a decision now because their vision has changed. Four of Cups here. Why is this Four of Cups here? We have the... Two of Wands in reverse, no longer at a crossroads here. I feel like someone was blocking their power here. Four of Cups, again, pulling on that Four of Cups. Someone was blocking their power, um, stuck in their emotions. Someone could have also been depressed or, or just like emotionally stagnant. Um, but I feel like there's a change here. Queen of Wands here. Someone is confident, uh, confidently making a decision here. Knight of Wands here. Lovers here. God damn. Baby, I'm on it today. Mm, I'm on it today. I'm on it today. So, uh, uh, lovers here with the Knight of Wands, someone is confidently making a decision. Will of Fortune here. And it is a fortunate decision. Someone's going to reap some very good benefits from this. Seven of Cups here. Why is the Seven of Cups here? We got the Two of Swords here. So, somebody's confidently making a decision. Choosy love. That's not choosy lover. Choosy lover. Popped up in my head. So someone is making a decision. I feel like someone previously um, was back and forth about a relationship. Stuck in themselves. Being emotionally stagnant. 
But now someone has found the motivation to move forward here, blocking off any other options. So someone could be trying to block off other options, put an end, like especially if they feel like somebody else got somebody else, they're like, mm -mm, that's over with. It's me and you now. Fuck what you heard. It's me and you now. So four of swords here. We have the eight of pentacles here. I feel like someone here is trying to work on rebuilding themselves. Four of swords here is inside their mind. Someone's trying to work on rebuilding themselves. Um, why is this high priestess here? I feel like there is some mental restrictions now. Six of cups here. So someone knows that they got to let go of the past in order to fool here, plant new seeds. Take Someone's letting go of a past situation to go towards something new. Why is this eight of swords here? Oi, oi, oi. Oi, oi. Oof, that was a lot. So seven of pentacles here with the judgment in reverse. Yeah, so someone was mentally restricted higher from here. I feel like someone's making peace with their mind here. So they may be still in this sort of mentally stuck place. Maybe they were unaware or even maybe still unaware that they're restricting themselves mentally. But Queen of Wands, they aren't restricting themselves spiritually someone is ready to take some there's some there's a fire that has been lit hermit here virgo energy here three of wands here someone's establishing their strength to take a leap of faith someone's taking a leap of faith i'm down in the, i want the world to know somebody's taking a leap of faith all right so let's put this back somebody's definitely taking a leap of faith Choosy lover. I feel like someone is choosing a lover. This may have been hard previously because someone had to change the way that they saw something or even saw this person. Could have been holding themselves back here until they had some sort of clarity. I feel like clarity is here. Someone has clarity. All right. So let's see. We're going to pull from and see what blessings you have. I, thought I was supposed to pull this first. What blessings do we have for Pisces, Summer, Rising, Venus for the month of July? We got Parasharam. Parasharam. The blessings you have are teaching ability, ultimate skill for all, skill, ultimate justice for all, my apologies, skill in martial arts and converting warrior spirits and qualities into peaceful ones. Okay. Let's see what we have here. We want to pull from the power of love and see what messages we have. What messages do we have? Can you get that for me, fat man? Thank you, baby. And y'all, don't talk about my baby nickname. My nickname is Fat, and that's Fat Daddy. But I call him Fat Man sometimes. So we got satisfaction here. It says, and don't don't be bragging on me for my nickname, okay? <laughs> I, my mama gave it to me, okay? Don't be ragging on me about my nickname. Satisfaction here. You let the energy of love guide you to self-approval so that others no longer define who you are. That was him threatening, y'all. Because he don't play about his mama. Let's see what, what messages we have for, the, for Pisces, okay? God of the arts. It says the artist within you is about to emerge. For a lot of you guys, this new path is going to open up some sacred. I told you, you had to find your power. Goddess of sacred power. You are being encouraged to take a leading role in your current situation. Mm. So some of y'all, this is about finding the confidence to make the decision. What messages? We're pulling from the rebel deck. Get your head out of your ass. Pronto. Pronto, motherfucker. Get your head out your ass pronto. And But watch out because shit could get ugly, okay? And it could be because some of you guys are being shady. So be very aware of that. This is all I have, Pisces. Until next time.